Hmm. What's up, y'all? I'm JB Black CEO, and welcome to Barbershop Talk TV out here in America. Who need to turn in their balls? Khalil Cook is what I'm going to say. And Nasha Wiggins, Malik, and the rest of them, Winner. You get it. The Cabo Six need to turn in their balls. Though. But look at the title up here before we go. Just look at the title. Don't forget, Shankula Robinson was video by so-called friend Khalil Cook, a.k.a. Cookie, Baby Powders, or either Chocolate Twinkie Powder, or either Powder or KC. All right, listen, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe, hit like, hit that notification button if you haven't. If you like what you're hearing, the way we analyze and I analyze this uh, Cabo 6 and Quilla Robinson Mexico case. So make sure you're going to hit those buttons. That way, when I do go live, especially the notification button, you'll get the notification and I'm going to bring you the truth off gate here at Barbershop Talk TV. Khalil Cook need to turn his balls in. This guy need to turn his balls into the nearest BP or gas station. We're actually to the nearest police department. All right, let's put it together, though. Let's put it together. We all, uh, then found out and analyzed that uh, Cookie right here, KC, Khalil Cook, um, had access to Coil of Light phone, I guess, passwords and codes. You know, her being a cool friend, you know what I'm saying? A, 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 you know what I'm saying? A, a Damn, a, a cool homie chick, you know what I'm saying? And and you got to be cool somewhere in there for her or for a female to let you uh, do that. And I think it's weird for a grown man want to have access to another young lady's phone like that. I mean, I got cool homegirl friends and not one damn time I felt like I need to be in their damn phone and they business owners and all that type of stuff. And it's just weird as hell why I need to walk. But anyway, this guy need to turn his balls in with Nancy Wiggins over there also. Khalil Cook. Okay, let's go to it. Hey, we, we see... Uh, we seen like two occasions where this guy had Quilla phone. You know what I'm saying? When Quilla was swimming nude and when Quilla was, uh, what you say, he got our first body, 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 dead body, 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 you know. But with that, you know, I can been at the party and we can say, my man, he gone to the world. You know what I'm saying? He to the world, whoop, 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 you know, he did, you know, to the world. You know, people pass out. Got some of the homies that boy pass out. You know, they get like three or four uh, beers in them, ale or whatever, and they out, you know. So we get it on that. Maybe, maybe not. It's the ass video in though. He videoed, say, fences her in the swimming pool. He videoed her, uh, you know, laying on the hammer. Let's go to the hammer real quick. Let's go to the hammer. Let's say Quilla, well, as we see, Quilla is knocked out, right? Quilla is knocked out. You can tell she ain't going to hit third gear, fifth gear in that hammer. And, and we were man say, boy, we got our first dead body, body, body. You know what I'm saying? Because when you look, Quilla is out. You know what I'm saying? She had a good time. Probably gonna got a full stomach. Probably had half a little beer or something like that. But that's not a drunk sleep right there. That's not even a drunk sleep. You know what I'm saying? That's probably a good tipsy sleep, though. That's just, you know. But anyway, guess who video? This one here. That one there. Cookie. Cookie. Baby pounds. He uh, all through the night. Tell again, tweet, you know, walking through the villa, leave Cabo Five, he go in there, you know, dang, let me, let me video, uh, let me see the quick, yeah, you know what I'm saying, okay, boom, he video, boom, boom, boom. Let's say when he finished video, how you look down and you bring it back, and sometimes women or some people get a little nosy, you know, he went play to the video, and damn, he probably started sweating through there. Let me see what she been texting. So. Now this guy, say for instance, I always check a text message Quilla don't get, like what he be having a phone for. It's something that this guy want the password for. It was something he does. What? Why he can't play damn bingo on his phone? Huh? He say I like to play this game. Why he can't download uh, uh, Tic Tac Toe on his phone? And when you look at it, maybe our sister was naive to this guy. Where even back in the United States, this guy was checking her text messages or something. You know what I'm saying? Just peeping it out. And that could be a reason why this guy get so mad and ovulating. So let's just say that night out there. Okay, cool asleep in the hammock. Mr. Man go through there and start checking her text messages. And we seen when Quilla came down the hallway and everybody in the back of the room. And when you get closer, Khalil heard him walk out and go in the room in front of uh Quilla, you know what I'm saying? Baby powders jump out there first, maybe saying, yo, is she coming or whatever? Let's say Quilla had in her text message, clear ugly. Does the name really, really good? All of them ugly, they don't look good, woo, 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 and they, 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 and you know, woo, woo, woo. And it made uh, Khalil Cook angry. It made him up, because she said he was, oh my gosh. 
And let's just say Quilla was keeping it real. Man, he shit and voice her pain on Desjardin. I'm just saying, what that night in the hammock, I'm saying, what if he after he finished that video, he went through a text message. But as we see, you know, we seen the flavor in there where they wasn't in, in the quilla when she got back there. You know, and Quilla was like, yeah, oh yeah, whatever, you know, how she got in the room, Khalil heard and dropped out, you know. What if this dude went through the phone? Quilla phone is private. She can say what she wants on it. Our phones is ours. But at this time, this sister over there probably drank or whatever, got loose, and forgot that this guy got the password to it. Maybe this guy was waiting to see what she's going to be texting somebody. Maybe he know that she have a friend back here in the U.S. that she be keeping it real with. You know, he be having her phone. And maybe he's seeing Quilla keeping it real about Cabo 6 over there. Cabo 5, Cabo 6, whoever was over there. We don't know, you know what I'm saying? We don't know how, all the shade that was going in. You know, so you think Quilla ain't going to be on the phone texting back to her people. You ain't going to call your mama all the time. You're going to text back to your peoples. I think it's some text messages out there, y'all, like Van Crump said in the, um, you know, in the news conference. I think it's some text messages. No, we know Ben Crump ain't representing him as attorney all this. So people don't come out to, yeah, Jay, you know, we know what he do. Yes, they got a turnover. He is bringing the news up here. So don't start educating me and us about no damn Ben Crump. We already know. But what if that's the text message that Ben Crump said that he got? Well, Quilla was texting back saying, man, they tripping on, you know, whatever, Dejanay, however, whoop the whoop. What if she said, you know what I'm saying? And, you know what I'm saying? And Malik looking like baby powder. It's like she probably, he looking like plats. Malik is flat. She probably, you know what I'm saying? Yo, and he, baby, how he, and, and Khalil all up on him. And they, they she old ball head or something. I'm just hyper, just saying. What if you seen that in there after he vetted that, you know, uh, our sister in that hammer? She knocked out, don't know that he checking the phone. Don't know that he checking the phone. Don't know that he checking the phone. He got the password, little slick brother right here. And it pissed him off, made him ovulate where this guy needed some motion like he was on this period. And he went back and told it. He went back and told the girls. He went back and told the girls what Quilla said or about maybe a text message. Ben Crump said they got the text messages. And so they can put it together. Who? The feds. Who? The United States government. They can put it together. They got the, the text messages where Quilla probably was texting a friend. Just got to put it together. And guess who's going to come back? It's gonna come back to uh, uh, baby powders right here, cooking. It's gonna come back to Dejanay. It's gonna come back to Pothead uh, Nazir. He over here, uh, uh, me, 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 me. Well, what happened to Quilla? Me, me, me. What happened to Quilla? Me, 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 me. What happened to Quilla, bro? Me, 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 me. Ah, ah, ah. All right, you can be singing that down in the yards of the North Carolina Department of Correction, bro. If it picks up with him over there, you look at him, he me, 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 and he got some people saying, oh, my God, I feel you. But I ain't heard that guy showing uh, too much love to Quilla, though. You know what I'm saying? Make some videos, playing some Luke the Van Trops to that guy. But that's another story. This guy behind me probably seeing some text messages after that hammock or whatever, got upset, ovulating, needed motions, or what is it? Uh, my sister's name used to, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I'm, I got like four sisters, you know what I'm saying? I grew up with more. He needed some type of medicine. We seen his mom have to take him to the hospital. After he came back over there, couldn't get it right and trying to hold up. What for? Because he didn't want none of that what Quilla got in that room over there. Mr. Cookie right here. Mr. Cookie probably went in that girl's phone and looked at her text messages and Quilla was voicing her pain back to the people in the United States. It's just my opinion. And this dude got pissed and went and told it. But listen, if you're new here to Barbershop Talk TV, make sure you subscribe, hit like, hit that notification button because I'm hype now. And I'm going to bring you the truth off gate. Because Lil Cook probably seen that girl text messages and was pissed. She called me Hagley and all of this and that's and they, oh, you hear what she said about this and they, Dang, that's the name. And then, ooh, Mal ooh, she said that about Malik Plies. I mean, Platts. She said that about Platts. And this guy right here orchestrated it right there. And it probably came from that night when we got after a dead body, 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 body. You know what I'm saying? Not when Malik uh, Nazir would have told us, ah, 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 ah. But Khalil probably went through that girl's phone and it was on like a pot of neck bones. 
where he got the ovulating, upset, hyperventilating, because what she said about him, he was probably his, it, his, his wit ends with Quilladine. But we'll see. The feds pick that up. I think they're going to be in the North Carolina Department of Correction, if not in the Mexico Department of Correction. I'm going to get up out of here. Make sure you subscribe, hit like to Barbershop Talk TV if you want the truth off gate. I'm out.